tell us your name and where you're from. I'm, my name is Diana, and I'm from Pasco. Awesome. Can you please share, us, share with us what was the sickness you were struggling with, and how did you get healed? I was colorblind all my life. Colorblind, couldn't. All I could see was black and white. That's it. Um, well, I, I could see colors. I didn't know colors. I didn't see the color you saw. I saw a, a different color, if that makes sense. But I knew black and I knew white, but it had to be real black and real white. And so you had this uh, for the longest time, as long as you can remember, right? You could not differentiate colors. No. All my life. All my life. How did that maybe affect your daily life? <laughs> um, well, it affected um, my goals in life. Um, I wanted to go one direction and couldn't because of my um, colorblindness. Um, jobs, couldn't work retail, found that out really quick. <laughs> it's the truth. Um, I was laughed out of a furniture store because I asked what color a uh, sectional was. Um, couldn't shop for myself, haven't been able to shop for myself all my life. Um, my sisters decorated my homes, um, helped me close shop, um, everything. Right down to matching shoes, socks, canisters for the kitchen. Um, everything, the color of hair, uh, makeup, everything, everything, which you look stunning, by the way. I love the colors. Thank you. Praise the Lord. Now, can you please share with us how the Lord healed you? Yeah, the question is, uh, where did you, uh, where were you in search of solution? Did you go to the doctors to receive any help from this sickness? There's nothing, well, I, I, there is one procedure, but it's not worth um, trying. The risks are not worth the possibility. Um, so it just, it wasn't going to happen. And it's chromos, it has, um, there's two ways uh, a woman can be colorblind, and it's very rare. Um, it's, chrom it's in your chromosomes or a traumatic brain injury. Um, I didn't have a traumatic brain injury that I know of, um, but so it had to be my chromosomes. Okay, and how did the Lord heal you from that? <laughs> so Saturday at church. I was telling my niece, Stephanie. Can we move so they can see the picture right here? So this is at the conference. Apostle John Chi is praying for her. And you, can you please share with us? Note to self, don't wear that shirt again. <laughs> so Saturday I was telling my niece, Stephanie, um, I'm believing that I'm going to be healed of one of my disabilities. I have two documented. Um, Preferably my color blindness. The other one doesn't bother me as much. Um, and I told her, I, I'm going to be healed. I know it. In fact, I think I even told Bryson too. Um, it's, nothing happened Saturday. Sunday came, and um, my nephew Bryson brought me up to the prayer line and he prayed for me, and instantly nothing happened. Then um, he prayed for the sections, and instantly, nothing happened. Or at least so I thought. And what happened next morning? Next morning, so I, I'm getting dressed, and I'm standing in front of my mirror in my bathroom on the, on the vanity, and I see a reflection of bottles in the mirror, and I know the colors of those bottles. I know them. I know the colors. And I started claiming those colors, uh, the green, the, the orange, the tangerine color. I have never seen tangerine. No, for reals. 
The colors, gorgeous color. Um, there's a lady here who's on your singing group, and her color, her shirt is beautiful red. That is yes, that's gorgeous, beautiful. Okay, can can you please demonstrate for us uh, what kind of color of uh, shirt I'm wearing? Now before, I would only be able to tell you that there's white in it, but there's blue too. Come on, put your hands together for Jesus Christ. This is awesome. This is absolutely amazing. We see how excited you are. So we are excited with you that the Lord heals. Amen. So can you please um, maybe share a word of, of advice to people who might be struggling with some kind of a sickness? What can you tell them? your healing will come in God's time. I've prayed for years and years and years to be able to see the way my sisters can see, um, the way you can see. Um, stop, si stop lights. Do you know how difficult it is to drive when they change the stop light from straight to side to side? It is difficult. I got a ticket. <laughs> in God's time, you will, you will be healed. Thank you. Come on, put our hands together for Jesus. <laughs>